What's up guys, King's Reaper here and welcome back to another episode of Escape from Tarkov playthrough. Now this episode was gonna be so much fun and it is gonna be so much fun. The first raid we need to do is on woods, trying to get some scav kills with a shotgun. Well, not to mention that this is a sniping map again where you need to go in with a shotgun but you know what, we can do it. We can do it. So the first raid we spawned again all the way across the map. I started pushing, looking for scavs, but unfortunately found none. And just as I was approaching the extract, I saw somebody move around here. So I was being a sneaky little bastard trying to find this guy wherever he was. Oh, and there he was. And I was like, where are those bullets going? So the first two bullets just like, missed? What? Well, nonetheless, we did kill this guy. We scooped up his gear, everything that we could, everything that was worth something. And he had quite a lot of gear and good gear. It wasn't bad. So I pretty much just looted up, checked his backpacks, checked his rig, and pretty much extracted with two scav kills and killing this dude. So after that, I was kinda not in a mood for playing woods anymore, so I picked up this beautiful AK that I picked off a dead body, or after I killed the same body, and pretty much went into another raid on customs. So this time, we were just hunting for players, going around, goofing around, not doing any quests, I wasn't looking pretty much forwards into doing some quests. So we spawned on the west side of the map, pushed all the way towards the extract almost when I heard somebody run around here. And this dude was quite unaware of my existence, which gave me an easy kill. And boy, he was looted with good stuff. He had so much good gear, that was amazing. Two filters, wow. Good scopes, motor, vodka. Well, I was pretty much happy with that kill and I was ready to go out. I didn't need anything else. But unfortunately, somebody else came here. Thankfully, he did not see me just yet. He was unaware of my existence as well. So there was only time to wait for that guy to come down and start pushing into my direction again. That was probably the player's cav, but you never know. So at this point, I was playing it really cautiously, just waiting for him to push, because that would give me an easy shot on him. And of course, when you move back into the body, you can't shoot straight. And that was another dude dead. But since he was a player's cav, he didn't have any good gear for me to pick off. So after having that two players killed, I went and extracted. After the extraction, I made some good money on the sales, I sold everything that those guys had, and I went in with another scav run. So after loading a little bit, we went into customs once again, and I spawned pretty much on the extraction point at the middle of the map, started pushing towards the end, when I found these players fighting around here. So that was one dude dead, okay. Ooh, he was just waiting for me. Oh, 
Well, I guess that was not a kill. Okay. So I was trying to flank this guy to get a better angle on him. I went up here. Only to find this guy. So this guy was not the one I was fighting with. And whoosh, he magically disappeared. The one second that it took to reload, he disappeared. I was still flanking around, trying to find this guy. I knew I lit him up hard, but unfortunately the dude was pretty much gone. I couldn't tell where did he go anymore. I couldn't see him, I couldn't hear him, didn't find him at all. So, the only thing that was left for me to do was go and loot the bodies of those other people that were fighting here. They had some decent gear, nothing extreme, but hey, everything's better than what you have on your scab, right? So pretty much just going through their inventories quickly, trying to take everything that's worth some kind of money. Hoping that the other guy is not gonna come. So after looting his body, I went on to look for the other body that I saw in this vicinity to see if this guy had anything worth picking up. Well, he had a rig, he had a filter, wasn't that bad. Then, after looting all that, I looked through the backpack and, oh yeah, this guy was also quite loaded when it comes to stuff. So I pretty much took the backpack, picked up all the gear and pushed toward the extract, which was right next to me. So I extracted successfully this time, it was kind of weird that I didn't kill that third guy, but anyways, we picked up our AK once again, ABS, and went into another raid, trying to get some player kills, trying to get some good gear, and trying to have some fun, instead of doing quests. So this time around we spawned on east side of the map, started pushing towards dorms, and just as I got here, Of course, no aim down sights and yeah, you're gonna hit zero bullets on that distance. I had to quickly use the painkillers because this guy was gonna push me. Definitely, I need to me. I need to be mobile. And finally, this guy was dead. So I push into the bush to reload my mags, to heal up a bit, in hopes nobody else is gonna come around and the players are gonna give me enough time to heal up. Unfortunately that was not the case. Another player kill. Okay. Now it was time to re reload the mag fully, switch the mags, reload the other mag, and then to loot the bodies. So I was fully healed and only waiting for some clearance in order to be able to loot these guys. So I picked up pretty much all the gear that guy had, picked up everything this guy had, and then started pushing towards the extract. And just as I was crossing, I heard somebody else moving around here. Oh, and that was a player. That was no scav. So I lit him up pretty much good. So what do I do? I push. I tried to go with a flashbang, but unfortunately it goes pretty much bad. I was too far in order to be able to flash him, so I start pushing. 
I didn't want him to know exactly where I was. He couldn't identify where my shots came from. And he was still in this container. So I was sneaking up on him, waiting for the perfect opportunity. And somebody else started shooting at this guy. What? And yes, the third party wins. Amazing. After having such a good start, the third guy killed me. I'm not even sure if it was a scav or if it was a player. I didn't check at the end. I think it was a player, so pretty much dead at the end. So again, money making raids. Go in with a scab. Now I was quite sure I heard somebody in here. Oh, there he was. There he was no more. Nice gear, dude. Not bad. An AK shotgun with a silencer, nice. This dude was pretty much loaded, had some good items for sale, perfect. After killing him, it was time to extract. I went out and extracted successfully and then sold all the goods that I could, picked up a good rig, a good gear set and it was time to go into another raid on customs. This time around, we spawned on the east side of the map in industrial area, so I started pushing once again towards the dorms. And as I came to the road to cross that split small and big dorms, I heard some people running around. Ooh, a squad. Unfortunately, nobody dies. Okay. That's fun. So I went back, reloaded my mag. And heard those guys pushing me. Well, it would seem that these guys were immortal. Or that my internet was lagging so bad that none of my hits actually counted. That's wonderful. So, I pretty much reloaded mags once again and decided to use this hole as my vantage point. Oh, they were looking for me. Ooh, almost got tapped by that Mosin. Thankfully, I did not get tapped. So I killed two guys out of three. After going around, flanking, searching, I couldn't find the third guy. He obviously ditched. I went out and pretty much extracted. So, this episode, I decided it was time to get something of great value for each and every one of your characters. So whoever plays knows that you should always buy one thing whenever you can and that is the sick case so after buying all the missing materials that i did not have that i would need for this trade we traded in all of it for the sick case and finally we had the sick case we had a better secure container and i was pretty much happy where this was going with but the following raids are going to be even more interesting so if you like this video please give it a thumbs up subscribe to my channel hit that notifications button and i'll see you in the next episode